Liam and Jayla film scenes for Mockingjay. Catching Fire has not even hit theaters yet, but Jennifer Lawrence and Liam Hemsworth are already hard at work on the set of Mockingjay, which, as you guys know, is the third book in the Hunger Games trilogy. The cast is currently filming over in Atlanta, Georgia, and in the new set of photos, we see Katniss leaning her head on Gale. The duo appear to be filming a hunting scene together, as Miss Everdeen is clearly seen rocking her good old signature bow and arrows on her back. As for Gale, he looks totally calm and cool in a navy blue button-up. And while we're on the topic of Hunger Games photos, just yesterday the new Entertainment Weekly covers that feature the Catching Fire cast members were released. Yep, Jennifer and Liam each have their own, as do Josh Hutcherson and Sam Claflin. Which one are you going to buy? Is it weird if I want all of them? I don't know. Tickets for Catching Fire are already on sale, and the movie hits theaters on November 22nd. Back to Mockingjay, though. Lionsgate is totally taking a page out of the Harry Potter and Twilight playbooks because the movie is going to be split into two parts. Part one has a current release date of November 21st, 2014, and part two will follow the year after on November 20th, 2015. I know, I know, it seems like a ways away, and well, that's because it is, but at least that means tons more sneak peeks and photos and interviews from the cast over the course of the next two years, right? Let me know which Entertainment Weekly magazine you are most likely to go out and purchase, and what do you guys think of these new pics of Gail and Katniss? Tell me below or send me a tweet, you guys know the drill. And then of course, subscribe and like this video. In Hollywood, I'm your host, Katie Krause. Thank you for watching and bye for now. You guys, our new show is officially launched. Episode number five is gonna go up today. So wanted to say hello to some really nice commenters. First of all, Ricky AFC, hey Ricky. He said, I love both of your outfits. I enjoy the Daily Hollywood Rundown and love how you always look happy, which brightens my day. And I can tell you're both really close friends. We are. I think Lord should just concentrate on her own life and career and not other stars' lives. And I think Taylor Swift should be star of the week because she's so classy in what she does and doesn't hog the limelight and doesn't have an ego like some stars. Okay, another vote for Taylor Swift. And then Flora Gucci said, I really love this show. Great idea, guys. Keep it up. Love you both. And then she signed it, Cleveret from India. All the way in India. That is so nice that you watch. Who are you voting for for Star of the Week, though? And who should be Cleveret of the Week? Go watch all the episodes. Make sure to get your votes in. We're going to pick them both on Friday. I'll see you guys later. Bye.